They know it ain't as widespread as what they saying. Uh, up and rising numbers. Right. Maybe only a hundred people died in like a whole week, and they say, "Oh, uh, six hundred thousand people died." Right. And, and, uh, they died from other flus or whatever, and they just add it. Yeah. Uh, you got a lot of people. Uh, gun violence. Second round, fourteen and twelve. They are talking about uh, uh every time I look, there's so many a thousand more deaths today. I can't even see how many people die like that. Come on, man. Like, how many how many funerals, AIDS funerals, have anybody went to? <laughs> and that was a virus. Yeah. They say that you don't even die from AIDS. You die from other complications. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. HIV. Yeah. That's because it, it tears your immune system up. Yeah. He's off the shit. And the reason why your immune system gets screwed up from eating all that damn chicken. <laughs> Chicken and cakes and pies and cookies. <laughs> cookies. <laughs> Go ahead. Well, it's, it's okay to eat those things. You just gotta be. You gotta be balanced with everything. That's Something that uh, Jake don't have. All right, go ahead, brother. This is Zechariah fourteen and twelve, and this and this shall be the plague wherewith the Lord will smite. All oh, the people that have fought against Jerusalem, their flesh shall consume away while they stand upon their feet. Uh, <laughs> it's going to be. <laughs> imagine having the sun touching. <laughs> imagine having the sun touching right here. <laughs> and everything will be burned up before it do get here. Imagine. <laughs> It just come close to the to, to the earth, and you can see nothing but rain. Oh. I want to I want to ask who the man of the uh, of the household is for with this couple. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's, it's amazing. Uh, who who's the man of the household here? Who's the man of the household here? What's that? Who's the man of the household here? Oh, uh, you look at him. Oh, okay, you look at him. Good. Oh, good, yeah, good. Right. I asked that because a lot of a lot of a lot of people, a lot of quote unquote men that come up here. When we ask them that, that woman be doing all the talking. And you know what they do? <laughs> hey, what did I ask hey, you that? That's not the situation. Right, your, wife, the situation. your wife will be happier when you leave. That's right. The woman really yeah. wants you to leave. And, and then, you know, it makes it better because she can do her part. And, you know, everybody do their part, which is to please you. Yeah. And, and make you happy. Yeah. We're, we're all on the same page. We're all on the same page. We're all on the same page. Yeah. That's yeah. good. Hey, yeah. our women will have better orgasms. If, if, they, if a man leg, you know? That's good. What are you guys doing today? What's this whole thing? Oh, we, we believe in the Bible? Yeah. Okay. Oh, you, okay. Well, we don't believe in, like, you have some Hebrews or like, that's who we are. Yeah. Some groups believe that you, some, they can look, if someone looked like you, they were devils and going into slavery. That's not the case. Some of our people look like you. Yeah. You know? Just because you have white skin don't mean you don't have... Uh, the flesh of a uh, so-called black man. Yeah. yeah. Right. Well, what's your nationality? Uh, it's like Scottish, Italian. Okay, Italian. Well, oh, he was showing your father's side. Uh, my father's. What is he? He's the Italian? Italian? Yeah, like full Italian. Okay, okay. Yeah. A lot of Sic- Sicilian, Italians? Yeah. They're us. You see, it's the father is the one that uh, produces the seed. Okay. The mother is, creates the mitochondria DNA. Yeah. The father creates the seed. So what we're teaching is, according to the Bible, the Lord is bringing judgment. That's why this somewhat hyped up coronavirus. It's all hype, but the Lord is bringing judgment to this place. Yeah. Famines going to come. They slaughtered sixty thousand chickens. You know, famines going to come. Pestilence, war, all these things are going to happen. And in the church, I guarantee you, your preachers and pastors they don't really teach you that, yeah. and they should be teaching that. Yeah. You know, in the book of Matthew, the twenty-fourth chapter. Um, any brother can get any scripture. I know you probably got to go, but um, the scriptures tell you that. Uh, Jeremiah 28 and 8. The scriptures tell you that the prophets of old are going to be back here prophesying again. Don't nobody like us. That's true. But did they like Jesus? Right? They never liked him. They, that's, that's why they hung him. Did they like the prophet Jeremiah? 
John the Revelator was banished on the island of uh, Patmos by Nero. And it wasn't just Nero, it was the people that said, we hate him, because they're teaching something different. So, all right, this is Jeremiah 28 and 8. The prophets that have been before me and before thee of old prophesied both against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence. pestilence. So we prophesied against all the wickedness that's coming about with our people. Yes. That's why our women uh, is uh, uh, is being pushed with the feminist doctrine. Yes. You know, the, the man is, oh, baby, please, baby. <laughs> you know, down on one knee grabbing a woman's ankle. And you know what? I heard women say that my old wife, she had a husband that did that years back. Yeah. Got down on his knees and grabbed her ankle. She said she felt disgusted by that. Because we're supposed to be leading, right? I mean, we're the stronger vessel, right? Get yeah, 1 Corinthians 11 and 8. We're the stronger vessels, right? So the stronger vessels for the lead. This is a rare thing that we see between you two. A rare thing, because if you can't lead as a man, she can't receive as a woman. That's what makes you happy. It's what God did. There's nothing wrong with a, you know, these women with the feminist stuff. Oh, you got to be equal to a man. There's nothing wrong with being a woman. What's the problem? You give birth? That's a great accomplishment. Go ahead. This is, this is 1 Corinthians 11 and 8. For the man is not of the woman, right? But the woman of the man. Go ahead. Neither was the man created for the woman, but the woman for the man. Right. It's an order. And a Babylon, America's Babylon. They tell you, hey, hey this is going to piss up. This might bother your wife. You, you can have, according to the Bible, you can have more than one wife. You're supposed to. That's why as a man, we desire women. Right? <laughs> she's not gonna, I ain't going to try to call the argument at home. She's not a fan of that. Yeah, no, yeah. It's okay. That's understandable because yeah. if you're Israelites and you get to the kingdom when it's played, we're not teaching that now yeah. in this society, you know, something new. But let me ask you a question. If it's like, uh, if you have 10 wives, right? All of them get pregnant. Who's the father? And all y'all were faithful. You would be the father, right? Now, if she had 10 husbands and she got pregnant, who would be the father? It's 10 different fathers. Huh? 10 different fathers. Yeah, it, it, one of them, out of one of them, somebody would have to be the father, but we wouldn't know. That's why Maury Povich is doing so well. You know? That's confusion. The Lord said, be fruitful and multiply. King Solomon had many wives, Right? There's many uh, kings who had many wives. Uh, was it uh, was it Jacob? King David, Jacob. They had concubines. Yeah. There was nothing wrong with that. Yeah, if you believe in the Bible, then you gotta know Jacob had 12, 12 sons. His two wives gave him two uh, concubines, one two handmaids. Yep. You know? Rachel and, and Bilhah. Rachel, Rachel, Rachel and gave him Bilhah. Bilhah and uh, right. Zilp, Zilpa. Yep. Zilpa. 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 For, uh, for women. Uh, for uh, it was nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. That's why the woman, she gets so mad, he cheated. It's really not his fault. Because that's just men. When you look at the, the, the in a pet world, right? You look at the dog, right? The dog don't hop the fence and hump on the female and say, you're my only. Let me put a ring on your paw. You know, it don't work like that. He going he gonna to hump on that dog. Then he going to go somewhere else and hump on another dog. Yeah. That's natural. That's nature. It's instinct. It's instinct. There you, there you go. go. There you there go. You go. All right, guys. Well, hey, we have okay. to get going, but you're preaching the good word. All, all right. All right. Hey, and it's, she's happy, too. So you're doing something good. Bye, guys. All, all right. right. All right, man. She walked off. She's going to be mad. <laughs> she got some walking. Okay. She's like, <laughs> Hey, the spirit had me stop him. I don't know why. I, I saw him all the way down there. I said, man, let me ask who the man of the household is. Yeah, yeah, that was yeah. the spirit. Yeah, I, I don't know what baby do it, but. The spirit. No, the spirit baby do it, yeah. It's like, if any of you supposed to step in, man, I just, I just, uh, uh, I was trying to stir up something because I thought she could be like, huh, huh? But hey, the spirit, hey, that man got that woman in order. Yes, yeah. yeah. They might happen? argue a little bit because he said, I agree. They might argue a little bit, but for the most part, he said, "Now nah, she's not with it. And that's understandable. Well, she ain't a nigga woman. She ain't a nigga woman. No. I believe she is too, though. I've seen you before, too. Yeah. 
once. She can be a heathen. Could be. Uh-huh. You know what I mean. That's nigga. <laughs> I say that to a nigga woman, she say, why can't I have 10 husbands? Yeah. Because you a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you done had goddamn canteens pushed up in your shit. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> you think about it, why would you want to be with a woman that had that, man? I mean, you can't help it now that she repents. Even still, you don't want to be with that type of, you know, you want to be the first. Right. And still, we all do, but unfortunately we yeah, can't. You can. That's how messed but up this place is. They supposed to have, they supposed to have some some shame about that. Right. Sure. right. But if they repent, yeah, if they if they're allowed to. Yeah. And guess what? Over time, her, her vaginal walls will uh, um, will come form to you again. Over time, as long as she ain't. Man, I them bitches know how to take vinegar bath to close that shit. Yeah, up, man. Hey, it's good to say that their desires belong to the man, to your man. They, they can't even question you now. If they decide to question the contract, we can't have that many men. Because you're already in heaven. Right. You're already, you're, you're already been slept down slept on about 100 years. And the scriptures, uh, it's a prayer. They got to purify. Uh, so the kings, uh, uh, now, for one thing, like if they got it from other nations, they would have to purify like a, year, a whole year. Take certain bath. And at the end, like you said, it tightens up, cleans them out. Yeah. Like yeah. if a woman. That's true. Like if a woman was raped unwillingly and she didn't mean it, they would put him to death, which we read in Deuteronomy. And that woman would have to go through a, a, a form of purification. But her value would still be lower. Yeah. Because men would be like, I don't really want her. She like somebody that already had it. She ain't a virgin. She ain't a virgin no more. So she would go to like a second class, you know, she would have to settle for somebody who might want to take her as another wife or something. And think about it. If we had an opportunity, if we had an opportunity like that, and you found out you had a, a woman over there, she was, had she had a husband or something, you're gonna be like, uh, right. But even though he died, you know, because you can still take a, a woman after you know after she her husband uh, died. Uh, yeah. And that's what we've been reduced to. The Israelite man, we've been like, uh, we've yeah, a lot of videos came out of. We've been reduced to messing with single mothers. And, and, and females that already had multiple men. Yeah. That's that's the value of uh, we had to go through in this captivity. See, we've been bought so long, but in the kingdom, that ain't going to happen because all our women are going to be fresh. You know, well, a man's supposed to have uh, women bird. Well, you go, Jake, on the lead. Jake has led the steed in there, mm-hmm. popping the young little girls' virgins and then running off yeah. because they didn't have any responsibility. Like young men, if you, you're 17 years old, 16, 17, 18, whenever you had sex with a, a woman for the first, her first time, and you knew at it too, you don't know how to take care of no wife. You wasn't raised to be a, a husband. Yeah, you wasn't. And in fact, uh, uh, in the hood, that's that's what they be trying to make you do anyway. Right. You know, you ain't a man unless you're getting some. Right. You know, they, they ain't, you got to be that that woman's uh, man. Right. You right. know, a lot of women got screwed over behind Jake for that shit. Big yeah. reason, like that big, that that grimy gorilla-looking coon that just walked by, that was arguing and shit. And it tell you the truth, I did some research, right? It wasn't that bad after the, uh, after the fifties when they uh, came with that order, and after the thirties as well, because they allowed Esau allowed the women to start working right. and stuff like that. You go back and do the research and look at the marriages within the black community. After they went by, everybody, you rarely had single mothers. Yeah. And that's amazing. I remember that. Yeah. I, well, when I was young, in the 70s, they had single mothers back then. Yeah. But, but it, it was like rare. That. It wasn't it like was it rare. is now. Yeah. And then go back to the 30s, it was rare. It was a shame. If you, it happened, but if, if, if it, it happened, it, it would be looked on upon as shame. But now yeah. women uh, take pride in it. But back then, in the 30s, she would have her head down. You know? yeah. It happened. But, you know, she would have, it, it would be looked upon. Right, remember the you movie Fences? Back then? Woman needed a husband, man. Go ahead, read the scripture. Yeah. Oh, no, no, go back to whatever he wants.
That's good to call him. Yeah, he's just to the spirit. Uh, you speak while he's getting the scriptures, you know. This is Zechariah 14 and 12. It says, And this shall be the plague wherewith the Lord will smite all the people that have fought against Jerusalem. Their flesh shall consume away while they stand upon their feet, and their eyes shall consume away in their holes. Uh, people are going to melt. <laughs> they are going to melt, all right? They say it's uh, not possible. It is. We ain't invisible. We ain't uh, made of uh, cast iron. When did that ever happen in history? <laughs> that never happened ever. <laughs> It says, and their tongue shall consume away in their mouth. Uh, your body is just going to be done for. It's pretty great. We made them what? 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 We It ain't going to be easy. It ain't going to be easy to take. So I didn't mean cut you, you know. I had to, I had to, you know. Because they, they got to they gotta know. Yeah, they got to know. That bop going to turn into a switch real they gotta, quick. It's still got to switch. It's still switch. Real. Look at her. It's still weak. She's still switching. She's trying to bop, but she ain't got it. Hey, man, all these women try to act all tough, man. Y'all ain't tough. Get the hell out of here. All the dice women have babies. Yeah, they have babies. They always having babies. You know. <laughs> right, she had to blast the music. Well, they're probably gonna be bored. They're gonna be bored. Yeah, yup. Yeah. Hey, we like getting under these women's skin, man. Uh huh. Go ahead, read the script. Come on. He says, It shall come to pass in that day that a great tumult from the Lord shall be among them. Right. Great tumult. Things are gonna get real. This place ain't uh, 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 always birth. That's what people want. They want the birth man. They want the birth of this man. They want uh, uh, Chick fil A's to be. Uh, uh, no, they already still open. Yeah, Popeyes and all that. They want Popeyes. They want uh, uh, McDonald's. They want everything. They want some uh, uh, more salt. They want to uh, uh, commit more uh, abomination. They want to have more, uh, commit more adultery. Which that may be a faster way of uh, spreading the uh, virus. These people are a virus, man. Yeah. They worse than COVID-19. Yeah. Much worse. <laughs> Niggas that killed more than COVID-19. You ain't had no national emergency off of that shit, man. The coronavirus is cleansing the air. Everything. 